I didn't think that would be the case. You know, I, I enjoy doing this. The sun has just come out and hit this bridge. Oh, hello everybody. Welcome back to another location video. Today, I'm in Surrey Keys. I came here with a buddy of mine to shoot uh, the city from the docks over at the city. Upon doing that, we saw this cool old pink iron bridge and it's called a bascule bridge. And I'm not really sure if I'm pronouncing that right, bascule or bascule, I'm not sure. It's on these sort of like a semi wheel, a half semicircle. And then what happens is that comes down and the whole bridge lifts up. It's not in operation anymore. It's completely monumental, but it looks really cool. And I really hope they don't get rid of it. So that's why I want to photograph it now before they do decide to replace it with, I don't know, flats or something. I'm going to go sans tripod today. No tripod, purely handheld, small location, but big opportunity. Right, so I've got loads of pictures in mind for this shot. Um, let's take a look around. So we'll show you a nice pair of trousers, look, how lovely. But uh, yeah, you can see the floor is a little bit covered in glass uh, and trees randomly, but yeah, lots of broken glass. Uh, so I'll need to be careful where I tread. So as always, we're gonna be shooting with the EOS R and the 16 to 35. The, the sun keeps on going in and out of clouds. So I need to wait for the sun to actually come out of a cloud and hit this pink bridge because when the sun hits it, it's this gorgeous, like, pinky orange glow. And it just looks amazing. Oh, it's hurting my feet. Whew. You ever sat on the balls of your feet for a long time? It hurts, man. One thing that is nice about this place is the gorgeous scenery. Just across this bridge, there is an amazing, like, Dockland area. Uh, just people taking strolls in the park and stuff. It's really nice. Like, probably a nice place to live as well. Um, but yeah, quite a pleasant on location. Come on, son. Come on, sun. No sun yet. It just doesn't look like the sun's coming out anytime soon. It's just gone behind a massive black cloud. I, I think we even might even get some rain. Anyway, let's take some photographs of this bridge. Also, a massive shout out to Optical Wonder for this peak design clip. It's pretty handy when you're on a shoot, I must admit. And a simple click, quick release. So yeah, cheers, Sam. Let's get this front on shot. This is looking real nice. That's nice, nice. Look for some pockets of blue. Here we go, we've got a pocket of blue up here. So I'm actually going to move down so I'm looking up at the actual bridge itself and just go down into the footpath. Could be awkward. But I don't care. Let's go. Let's move around here. Let's move around the front to get like a proper front on one. Look at these views. make this work. See that chair? I want to take a picture of that chair. Sometimes you're just lucky and these random objects just appear out of nowhere. Well, that was unexpected. All right, back up the top. Look at that. Lovely. When I managed to get a couple of shots where the sun came out for a little bit, literally a few seconds, and cast a bit of light on the bridge. So yeah, I'm pleased with those ones. I'm glad that it popped its head out just a little bit for me. That's very sweet of it, very kind of it. All right, let's do a long exposure. I think it might look quite cool. Son's tripod today. No, no tripod. Right, we're set up and ready to go, apart from one minor detail. And that is because we're doing a long exposure in broad daylight, we all know the longer we leave the shutter open for, the more light is going to get into the sensor. So what we need is an ND filter. <clears throat> Which I didn't bring. Because as you know, always on this channel, I have to forget something. <sighs> I'm just going to do an experiment. I'm going to shoot it. Let's go six seconds and let's see if I can recover anything in post. This would be a good test for the, uh, for the raw file. Right, I'm not expecting big things here. That's it for the video anyway. So uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Quite a quick one today, I think. 
honestly this is so typical as i was packing up the sun came out so i've had to run around take all the shots i just took again um but yeah so now i can actually share some sunny shots with you That's all, bit of a short video today, but I knew I wanted to get out and shoot this location. I knew the clouds were in and out, the sun was in and out, so I thought I'd chance it and get out. I'm glad I did, because in the end I got lucky. And I know Mike Chudley put a shout out on his last video to come and over to my channel, so thanks so much for that. And hello to all the new subscribers. It, honestly, it helps massively. I think I'm on like 196 now as we speak. Completely blown away, love it. Honestly, thank you so much. Again, hope you like the video, and I'll see you later. I'll see you in the next one.